Before the mid-80s, forensic science was limited. Fingerprints were rare. Eyewitnesses were unreliable. Solving crimes often felt like a shot in the dark. Justice frequently slipped away. But in September 1984, a discovery in a quiet UK lab changed everything. Geneticist Dr. Alec Jeffries was studying DNA when he noticed something extraordinary. Repetitive patterns that varied wildly between individuals. He realized these unique patterns were like a genetic barcode. An individual fingerprint written in our DNA. Except unlike a literal fingerprint, every cell in your body carried it. The implications were staggering. Just two years later, in 1986, Jeffrey's work faced its first real test. Two young women had been brutally murdered in Leicestershire. Police suspected one man, but lacked definitive proof. DNA fingerprinting didn't just find the killer. It exonerated an innocent man who had confessed under pressure. It then linked the crimes to a new suspect, Colin Pitchfork, proving his guilt definitively. This single case launched a revolution. DNA evidence became the gold standard in forensics, solving cold cases, freeing the wrongly accused, and sending countless criminals to prison. Justice finally had an undeniable witness, but its impact stretched far beyond crime. DNA fingerprinting revolutionized paternity testing, identified victims of disasters, and became a cornerstone of genetic research. It unlocked the secrets within our very cells.